We'll continue our highlights featuring a team that doesn't have to worry about making the playoffs. The Oceanside Pirates hold on tight to their number one spot as they welcome the Ramona Bulldogs. Stormy Bonantoni joins us from the Pirates' den in Oceanside. What's up, Stormy? Thanks, Erica. I'm over here at Oceanside High School where Toby Pow Pow and the 6-1 Pirates are looking to extend their five-game win streak against the 4-3 Ramona Bulldogs. Now, I know Ramona's coming off two losses on the road, but this could be a closer game than anticipated. Let's look at the highlights. As always, Pirate Pride was in full force at Oceanside. Headed to the first quarter, third and ten for the Pirates, a quick toss and run to number 22, Ty Cottrell, who never fails to deliver on some fancy footwork. He'd take it down the field for 47 yards, helping William Goley to score a play later, 7-0. Oceanside's next possession, the handoff again to Goley, who's going to charge through Ramona's D and in the end zone. Oceanside's up 14-0. On to the second, Hunter McCarg fades back and fires it out to tight end Christian Drews, who's going to be taken down just short. McCarg would punch it in on the quarterback keeper. With the extra point blocked, Ramona's down 21-6. After taking a sack on the previous play, McCarg is hit again. The ball comes loose, and number 45, William Gulley, swoops in for the fumble recovery, setting Oceanside up to score again. It'd be 35-6 at the half. Third quarter action. The Pirates are really just piling it on now. Tofi Pow Pow hits number 21. TK Dodds in the front corner of the end zone. Scores now 42-6. Pow Pow's going to hand the rock off to Cottrell, who's going to sprint toward the sideline. Looks like he might get caught up. Uh, not quite yet. He gets a solid 33-yard gain, leading the Pirates to Shad Keegan to finish it off. Final score, Oceanside 49, Ramona 6. I caught up with William Goley for his thoughts on the win. Basically, the line just did a great job protecting and run blocking, and we were able to, you know, put the points on the board. <laughs> Well, that was a rough one for the Bulldogs. Honestly, Oceanside had complete control on both sides of the ball, dominating every aspect of the game. Hopefully, Ramona will have better luck next week when they play Torrey Pines at home. Sending it back to you in the studio, Erica. Stormy, Oceanside always seems to play so effective. Why, why is that? Well, it's no question that Oceanside just continues to prove themselves week after week, and I think that their effectiveness starts with Coach John Carroll. He's done a phenomenal job with the program over the years and continues to develop these players. You know, and it doesn't hurt to have such standout players like Tofi Pow Pow, Ty Cottrell, Jace Whitaker, William Gulley. The list could go on forever. They're just a very talented and athletic team that is really great to watch. Back to you, Erica. Thank you, Stormy. Great job. The Pirates look unstoppable right now. If you're a football fan, you're not going to want to miss their game against La Costa Canyon this Friday night. Definitely not. Yeah, number one versus number two doesn't get any better than that.